Greetings and welcome to day three. Ah, oh, man, it's been so wonderful and miracles are just manifesting so rapidly for me. Uh, yesterday at the end of day two, uh, I thought I was sleepy <laughs> and I laid down to uh, go to sleep kind of early because I had um, early appointment this morning and I napped for maybe 15, 20 minutes. Um, and then, oh my God, man, I, I just had all of these, these incredible thoughts, like these, um, the fill in for the gaps of some things that I was doing. And, um, and, and they were so right on point for me. So the mental clarity and the mental alertness is, is already, uh, evident for me from my experiences at the end of day two. Normally, I would uh, get to that point maybe like after day three because normally the first three days, uh, you, you kind of go through headaches and stuff like that um, because you're ridding all of these toxins and, and other things from out of your system. But thankfully, uh, mine has um, started right away. And I was so encouraged and so thankful for the uh, messages um, and intuition that I received last night. So, man, I was up till 1, 2, 3 o'clock in the morning just taking notes of everything that was being downloaded to me. So I wanted to, to make sure that I expressed that. And secondly, you know, if it wasn't for two incredible crucial people in my life I would not be on this journey and so I want to give a shout out to Casey Ware my beautiful niece in Las Vegas and Anthony A.K. King also in Las Vegas that's my nephew uh, he's an incredible incredible individual he's a music producer uh, he got me in the studio <laughs> A couple of times and he he's just awesome and so Casey explained the concept around you and therapy and again it's been so long ago that I don't even remember when it happened but I took that information home with me and just uh, digested it and just kind of stayed with it and AK would repeatedly give me additional information to support what it is I had just learned about uh, with joint therapy. And um, from there, I did my own research a little. I, I didn't do a lot, just a little. But I also asked uh, a couple of uh, naturopathic doctors whom I trust very much here in Atlanta. And they both highly recommended it, um, along with one that recommended uh, doing a water cleanse, just plain water for at least 30 days. And so that's the type of endorsement this uh, practice has received. And it's nothing new, it's, it's not all the, out of the box and, and it's not weird, <laughs> all that other stuff that you may say that it is. Uh, it's been practiced for eons and eons. I know myself, um, I'm 69 and when I had my child, uh, and then when my, uh, I know when my aunties and, and cousins and sisters and brothers and things like that, as children were coming into the world, if they had a problem with their skin, you know, like a diaper rash or a heat rash because we put too many clothes on them, you know, and just whatever, we always took the, the wet diaper. Just keep in mind that back then we didn't use pampers and all those artificial things. We used pure cloth diapers. And so we would take that cloth diapers to, to wash the face and to rub on the baby's body and the rash went away like that. I mean, just, just so fast. And so we knew that this worked. And uh, even talking with my mom, she had had uh, some other experiences with urine therapy too, but you know, as we go along, we think, ah, you know, I don't, I don't want to force that on my children. I want to give them something new and something different, and uh, that's just something that we should return to. And that's why I feel so at ease with uh, doing 
the urine therapy. Um, it, it really, it tastes wonderful. And so you see, I have my glass here and uh, I just absolutely, absolutely uh, enjoy the practice. And so a big shout out to Casey Ware. I'm so glad that you were able to follow that prompting in you from your intuition and the things that you were being told and AK for just understanding it and putting so many spiritual principles and scriptural principles behind it so that we fully understand um, the impact of, of water. And um, so it, it is documented in, in the Bible in um, talking about our waters and how they benefit our body. And so I would just recommend and, and highly suggest to you that uh, you don't just boohoo it away or, you know, like, ah, I can't do that. We must think outside the box because the box that we're in is literally killing us right now with all the medications, all the diseases, the toxins and this and the toxins and that. It's time we give ourselves a chance. And um, this is one way. It's your own body. It restores your stem cells. It resets your body. It um, provides you nutrients and, and minerals that you don't get other places. So, again, this is Sandy Rogers. And this is the end of, well, not the end. This is day three for me. It may be the end. So, no, because I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. And I've been up and at it for quite a while. So, I love you. And I hope you would consider this. And um, we'll do possibly a demonstration tomorrow. I'm not sure. I love you, though. Have a good one.